I can assure the American businessmen that uh, as uh, in any other continent uh, in the world, uh, as in any other country, business uh, is done in Benin as uh, uh, the way it is done here in the U.S. There may be a language barrier because uh, Benin is uh, a French-speaking country. However, the business language in Benin is most likely English language. And uh, talking about some of the threats that people talk about, uh, Benin has been a democracy since 1990. We have the same ideal, the same value, and the same aspiration as the American people. Uh, therefore, we see things exactly the way the American people see things. Uh, you can set up a business in Benin in one hour. Yes, so you could do that, which is important for somebody who's coming in. You can uh, 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 re, uh, re repatriate all your uh, most of your income. Uh, the tax uh, uh, is a uh, uh, law are clear enough, and uh, you don't need uh, a local partner. Benin has been awarded about $400 million, which is going to be invested essentially in the energy sector. So this is a, a, a great opportunity for U.S. companies that wanted to uh, 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 come into Benin to produce, generate, and distribute power. Because the power sector is uh, uh, very open and the need is there. Then, so we we also, we're talking about hydro, for example, but beyond that, we have also services because there is going to be some policy in the energy sector that will be put in place. So consulting firm that have uh, expertise in that area will be interested in coming in and bring that expertise, uh, uh, for example. And uh, we talk about biomass, for example, which are some projects that are, uh, they have off-grid project and on-grid project. So when you look at Benin, tiny Benin, but I like to say to people, big uh, footprint. Because you come to Benin, it's just like you right there at the gateway of uh, those countries, which is about 300 million uh, people, ECOWAS. And usually when you look at the size of Benin, it's best suited for small and mid-sized companies. They can go uh, uh, online on our website to look for the standard, or they can call my office. Like I tell people, uh, I tell you business, when you're a businessman, you just open, you just come to the embassy, you don't need an appointment. An appointment. Better yet, call me and meet me at the airport in Benin. That's what I would like to invite people to come to Benin and to do business and uh, I guarantee they will make money, a lot of money. You have the, most of the growth is happening in Africa. And because most of the growth is happening in Africa, I think uh, we, uh, we need that partnership to be able to sustain that growth, but also to help each other grow.